Hey, what is up guys? John from Magic Tech Review and in today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to set your Me Metro PCS APN settings. So go ahead and leave a like on the video, subscribe to become part of the Magic Tech Review family. And yeah, let's go ahead and get right into it. Oh yeah, and click that bell, of course, to be notified of whenever I go live. So basically when you want what you want to do with your Metro PCS, um, once you put your Metro PCS card in there, uh, you might not be getting your 4G signal and whatnot. So what you want to do is make sure you're not in airplane mode. And uh, this is especially good for unlocked phones. Let's say you're you're bringing a you know iPhone or you're bringing no, I'm sorry, not an iPhone, <laughs> uh, Samsung Galaxy, something unlocked from Verizon and whatnot, and you need to put your APN settings in. A lot of times. What will happen is you'll bring over a phone to Metro PCS, you'll stick your SIM card in there, and your phone calls and your text messaging will work right away. But then the dreaded thing happens is that you can't use your internet right away. So what you're gonna do is, and I've done this plenty of times with many of phones, so just go ahead and take notes on this. Pause when you have to, and yeah. So you're gonna allow mobile data access over networks. You're gonna click on your data, you're gonna click on data roaming, you're going to have your LG LTE on. You're going to have the disabled 2G off. And then you're going to go to access point names right here. You don't want to really, you don't really want to mess with this thing right here, net, network operators. So don't mess with that. And then what you're going to do is you're going to put in this right here. So you're going to put, you're going to actually type in the name right here and you're going to put in Metro PCS. You're going to put in the APN, which is fast.metropcs.com, proxy port not set, username not set, password not set, server not set. Then you're going to go to MMSC, and then you're going to type that in right there, HTTP colon forward slash forward slash metropcs.mmsmnmvno.com slash MMS slash WAP ENC and then you're gonna put in right here MCC 310 260 that should pretty much be already there and then this is an important thing right here as well APN type should be default supple high pry and photo if you do not put those in then your messaging will not work so just keep in mind of that APN enabled and there you go pretty much you put that in And you can also put this one in as well. I'll go through this one really, really fast. Metro PCS right there. APN TMUS. T-Mobile USA basically. But TMUS. And you got to do these as the exact same way. So no capitals or no punctuations. None of that craziness. Then you go to MMSC. HTTP. Colon forward slash forward slash Metro PCS dot MMS. MVNL dot com forward slash MMS forward slash WAP ENC and then 310 260 again and APN enabled and APN type MMS there you go and there you go so uh, the way you would actually do it is you would actually hit this right here where where the plus sign is so I'm actually doing this on my ZTE Blade Z Max, but obviously you can do it on any uh, phone that you have, and this will get you for that. Uh, I do have a one, a one for Cricut Wireless, so if you need to find Cricut Wireless one, you know, there you go. I have a video on that. All right, guys. Well, this has been John from Magic Tech Review, just giving you a quick tip and tutorial on how to put in APN settings to enable your uh, web browser and whatnot on your phone, on your Metro PCS phone. All right, guys. Well, peace out. Thanks for watching. Any comments or questions, please leave them in the comments below, and I will answer them uh, as, as I can. And I will see you guys in the next one. Thanks for the view. Peace out.